Hey there, it's Thursday, February 3rd, 2011. It's Ryan Charles coming to you with the Lone Giants Daily with a thought, and a thought I want you to think about and tell me why this would not work. Now I realize this idea that I'm about to pass along is not ideal, and it's not gonna be popular with realtors and mortgage people, title people alike, but think about this. There are currently 250,000 homes, approximately 250,000 homes, owned by Fannie Mae and Freddie Mac right now that are on the market. Now you know as well as I do, in real estate as in any business, it's all about supply and demand. Now these 250,000 homes in the United States currently are unoccupied and for sale. Here's the thought I want to pass along to you. Let's rent these places. Let's get people in these homes. They can't, we can't sell them. If we could sell them, let's sell them. But if we can't, let's get these off the market. That way these other properties can sell. Let's put these in uh, lease to own category. Maybe one, two, three year lease to owns. Let's get people in these houses, let's get the plumbing working, let's keep the lawns cut, and overall maintenance uh, up on these homes. Now keep in mind, with, in a rent to own scenario, these people are gonna wanna take care of the house because they're planning to own it one day. I think it would work. Now here's the thought. Out of these 250,000 houses, let's say we rent these for an average of, say, 1,200 a month. That 1,200 a month is gonna equate to $3.5 billion a year. It's a lot of money that we currently don't have. Plus, like I said, these houses are going to be upkept. I want someone to shoot holes in this idea. Please give me some comments below, forward it along, and let's talk about this. Just an idea. I know it's, it's not the way that the government-sponsored entities, the GSEs, are set up, Freddie Mac and Fannie Mae, but this just might work. Tell me why it won't. Coming at you tomorrow for Fun Friday, Ryan Charles, Lone Giants Daily. Subscribe over here, forward it down here, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye. By the way, if you watched the daily from yesterday, we were talking about Groundhog Day and if Phil's gonna see a shadow. Well, it turns out he did not. That means it's gonna be an early spring and you can tell that to the people in the Midwest right now.